been wanting to brush up on my knife carving skills. I'm not really a very good knife carver, but I'm learning. And uh, so I went up on the hill and uh, cut me a little section of uh, the pear wood. I didn't realize how hard pear wood is, but it's pretty hard. Anyway, I've managed to get this far with it. I'm going to just continue and get as far as I can, make a little trout handle on a spoon. And uh, I'm just going to do the entire thing with knives. I did use a saw a little bit on my knife to make these cuts. Other than that, I just want to use a knife and maybe finish up with sandpaper and call it good, whatever it comes out. It's kind of a folk art uh, style. I'm out here today in the country and just enjoying it. We, 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 we had so much snow here about a week and a half ago and then it melted off and and I'm able to get out here in the woods and enjoy the country again. I think it's funner to me just to take a stick and try and make something out of it. I just really enjoy that. If I could, that's what I'd do all the time. Just an old man sitting on his porch car and whittling. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be a coffee scoop, by the way. I don't think anyone would use it for a spoon, but it'll be a coffee scoop.
Well, that was a fun little project. I wasn't sure how uh, pear wood was going to carve, and it didn't carve very easy. Uh, it's really hard wood, but boy, it, it finished up nice. I just took a, a 600 grit sandpaper and went over this after carving it as smooth as I could, and then the 600 grit uh, finished it up, and it just feels super smooth. Um, I don't, I'm not too anxious to start another uh, carving with pear wood because you got something to say, Pearl? What do you got to say? <laughs> um, but the way I'm gonna I'm gonna put a finish on this, um, it's a uh, walnut oil. This is Mahoney's finishes, and it's a food safe. Uh, walnut oil and I'm just gonna rub it on there it uh, it dries up and it'll protect it and keep it from absorbing anything and, uh, or hopefully it will anyway but I think it'll be a good finish to put on it likes this oil. So as much fun as this was to do, I thought I'd want to try it again. So, uh, but next, instead of using pear wood, I think I'll use uh, water birch, which grows along the creeks up here in the mountains, and just see how freshly cut water birch will carve. So I'll make another spoon with that.